Hello everybody, it's Michelle Patterson here with Angel Souls and this is our daily card reading for April 1st, 2021. Happy April. Okay, so first off we have Azurite, get laser focused and Sunstone, take pleasure in the things that you do immediately. I'm kind of laughing here because it feels like you get fed up. So what's our focus for today? Get laser focused. <laughs> no, but this comes from like a you know what? I'm done with this. I'm done being disappointed. I'm done feeling like I'm not getting anything accomplished. I'm done feeling down. I know that sounds weird. Of course, always make sure that you have proper support. But some of us are really taking our power back <laughs> in our lives. Now, if you're anything like me, I will sit here. You know, I'm a, a gig worker, a freelancer. I do everything myself. I used to be so neat and tidy, you guys. And now I do my dishes when I'm out of forks. Why? I don't have time for stuff. <laughs> I just don't. Uh, so I finally will be in like a messy apartment. You know, I got to get my tax receipts organized. I got to do, you know, grocery shopping. I have to do the laundry, whatever. And I will get to this point where I'm so sick and tired of worrying about it that I'm like, nonsense stops. I get up, I throw that laundry in, I get my forks in the dishwasher. <laughs> I sit at my computer and I do the editing and I line up my reading list, my personal reading list, angelsouls444.com if you would like to sign up for one. I get my list ready for the next day. If I'm going to be batch filming, I get my shot list ready. You know, I'm doing all those things and then I get done. I'm like, yeah, that's how you do things. <laughs> so don't, <laughs> for some of us that doesn't work. Okay. For some people that may not be the thing, but this has that kind of energy around it. That's why I'm giving that as an example where you just get tired of worrying about it. So you take care of it. Yes. Now for a lot of you out there, this is going to be finding, we, we just kind of generally call it our purpose, but this says take pleasure in the things that you do. And it's sunstone. Sunstone is a very prosperous stone, but it's the prosperity that comes from just loving life and feeling good about what you're doing, right? So whatever it is for you, some of you might make a major career move, not today. Okay, don't quit your jobs today, <laughs> okay? <laughs> this is a process that starts today. So let that be your focus. But you're getting clarity and you're being truthful. And look at this crystal. Again, it's a combination of blue. Well, let's, let's go deeper. It's blue and green, but it's sort of an indigo, a light blue and the green. So this is the third eye chakra, the throat chakra, and the heart chakra. Think about the wisdom that could come from all that, right? So this is asking you, this isn't about pushing. This isn't about <laughs> that fed up energy and then you get impulsive and you go scrambling ahead and you trip over your own feet. But this is that kind of thing. It could be as simple as, you know, on my bucket list, it's always been learning piano. So... I'm terrible at it so far, <laughs> but whatever. I stick with it a little bit every day, but I stick with it. I just sat down, I got the app and I'm like, yes, let's just do it. 10 minutes a day. What's the problem? Or, you know, whatever it is for you. I've always wanted to try this one thing. So let me get focused on figuring out how I can do that. Now, this could be an overwhelming time for some, again, because there's this, what it is, it's a flood of energy. I don't know where it's coming from, okay, <laughs> but I'll take some. I'll take a little of that to get some stuff done. But it's a flood of energy, a flood of uh, clarity here. I'm curious to see if this is Archangel Michael. It's not. Zadkiel. Transmutation. Ah, Joe Flail again. Beauty and wisdom. Ariel. Make stuff happen. That's what Ariel comes forward and says, get on it, <laughs> okay? Also about nature, detoxifying through nature. Uh, material abundance. I think like root chakra kinds of things. Yes. And then of course, Gabriel is back giving us nurturance and love. And this is how we find our peace guys. This is what needs to happen. I have so many clients who come to me when I do my, my uh, personal readings for people and they come in and they just say, you know what? I don't know what direction to go in. You know, this, this, and this is what's wrong in my life. And that's not that shocking because the third dimensional ego consciousness was put there to function like that, to keep us protected. Uh-oh, warning, warning. Career's not going so great. 
hate my coworkers. <laughs> I swear if that one comes up to me one more time and says X, Y, and Z, you know, and you know, I might not have a way of supporting myself. Uh oh, I may not, you know, be accomplished in this world. And then what will everyone think? Or warning, warning, love partners being a little moody today. Am I about to get dumped? And if I get, if I get dumped, then that means I'm worthless because then I'm single again. Toxic thought grid. Think about it. Get rid of it. Don't allow it to flow through you. The more people that start waking up to that and we start saying no and we seal off our energy, we'll be containers of light. And it will have to dissipate because it's not being fed. Yes? So we have to keep that in mind. So anything that starts sounding off the warning bell, as I tell my private clients, it's not about the outside situations changing so that you can be at peace and be happy. It's about you changing from the inside and watching the results catch up with you on the outside. All right? That's what you're dealing with today. So we're going to leave it there. I'm sending you all so much love and take care. Bye-bye.